The Senate has urged the Inspector General of Police, Usman Baba, and other heads of security agencies to, as a matter of urgency, carry out comprehensive investigations into the recent killings in Ebony State by alleged herdsmen. It also called for the federal government's intervention to end in the killings of citizens in the state as well as across the country. The resolutions were reached after Ebony North Senator Sam Igu raised the point of order on the various attacks on a village in Umbu community of Ohauku local government area of the state by Hertzberg. 12th day of April 2021, the alleged herdsmen and Aguila people again invaded Otuebu, Igidobu, and Ndiagu Ibe Oba village in Umogido Apu communities in the Hoku local government area of Abbey State and grossly killed over 12 innocent indigents, burned and destroyed over 56 houses, and kidnapped five persons. The President of the Senate, Ahmad Lawan, urged the federal and Ebony state governments to put appropriate measures in place to forestall further attacks. He also directed the National Emergency Management Agency, NEMA, to immediately intervene through the provision of relief materials to the families of the victims and displaced persons in the affected communities. Prior three, direct the Nigerian police and other relevant security agencies to carry out comprehensive investigation of these dastardly attacks and to promptly arrest and prosecute the perpetrators as well as rescue kidnap victims that are still held captive. Those in favor of this prayer say aye. Those against any direct Prayer four, urge the federal government and the state governments to put appropriate measures in place to forestall further attacks. Those in favor of prayer four say aye. Those against any direct In a similar development, Senator representing Plateau North, Estefanos Giang, also cited Order 43 of the Senate to inform the Parliament on the recent attacks and killings of citizens in Plateau North. To call on government and the security agencies to do all that is possible to address the situation. A minute silence was also observed in honor of those that lost their lives in the gruesome attacks. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.